Welcome everyone, Adam the Woo here, TGIF to you. I'm standing here in a flooded out parking lot on Highway 192 in Kissimmee, Florida. Hope you're having a good day so far on this Friday. It's my second channel, Daily Blog Channel. Today we're talking about memories and my memories. It's the Daily Woo. Thank you for joining me. I just want to say a big, humongous thank you to everyone who watches my daily vlog blogs and enjoys them. Sometimes they're good, sometimes they're bad, but they're always, always, every single day. Can't always hit a home run every day, but I, I am really thankful and happy for those that are sticking around through just the base hits. You can't always hit a home run, but normally it's a base hit. I would say sometimes a double or a triple. I don't know, maybe a stolen base, maybe a bunt. Maybe this one is a bunt. Is this video a bunt? Or is it a home run? You decide. When it's over, you can leave a comment down below, whether it's a home run or a base hit or a strikeout. Anyway, to the subject at hand here is a flooded parking lot. Years and years and years ago, I used to work on this spot, and I parked my car right there in that flooded parking lot. This is the old River Adventure Golf, and this is all that remains. Not a whole lot. There's the main entrance coming off Highway 192. This might look familiar to those who've watched my videos for years. Man, I got a mosquito on my arm. I gotta itch my hand. Mosquitoes out here now with this festering pool of water behind me. You can definitely imagine how many mosquitoes are out here in Florida. A lot of mosquitoes in Florida, especially when there's standing water. And I'm standing near the standing water and I have flip-flops on. I don't even have shoes on. And I'm going to go up there and show you what remains of River Adventure Golf. Like I was saying, this might, this might look familiar to you because two years ago, two and a half years ago, when I first started doing YouTube videos, I came out here when it was still erected. It was closed, but it wasn't in this kind of bad shape. Now they bulldozed it. And I kind of came out here and I showed what it looked like. If you want to look up that video, it's called Abandoned River Adventure Golf. I'll put a link down below to my first video a couple years ago. Let's call this one The Return to River Adventure, the return to adventure. Come with me now as I reminisce along with you. You're gonna live vicariously through me and my memories right now. I'm gonna trudge through this mud in my flip-flops. This right here was the main office. You can see the bridge right over there. Guests and customers would come in and they would approach the main office here and they would rent their clubs and their golf balls and they would play a riveting game of golf. Whoa, this is kind of mushy. It was kind of mushy. Try to go across here. Woo! Check this out. There's my van way over there. Here is where the little clubhouse area was. All up here were rocks, waterfalls. Wow. You know how many times I walked down this? Coming into work, I would greet the guests. Here was the final hole right here. This was the final hole. If you got a hole in one, you got a free game. You should watch this video and definitely go watch the other video, what this place used to look like when it first became abandoned. When it first became abandoned before they tore it down. But evidently, they did not do a great job of tearing it down. Because there's still a lot left. There used to be cars. When I worked here, the manager I had, the woman who was the manager that ran this place that operated it, told me they used crushed cars from a junkyard to make the hills and the mountains. They probably removed the cars. You can almost see remnants of metal and junk and all kinds of things in here. Probably scraps from cars way up there. This was the top of the mountain. Of course, the golf range went all the way up top. My feet are sinking into the sand. My feet are sinking into the sand. See, here's some remnants here. Wow, look at this. Part of the golf course still left. It's kind of sad. Do you have any memories in your life of where you used to work or visit? Of course you do. It's really crazy to come back out. Oh, I got sand all over my feet. Hold on. Ooh, glass. Walking around in glass and sand is not a good idea when you're wearing flip-flops. Look at my feet. My feet are down there getting sand and dirt all over them. Anyway, like I was saying, you have any memories 
And what is it like when you return to something that's completely destroyed and crushed and decayed? Something you have fond memories of. I remember when it would be slow out here and there was no guests coming in and no tourists coming off the main road. This was hole number one. I would go out here, I would take my golf club, and I would play hole number one. I was an expert at hole number one because I shot the hole about 9,000 times. So I could get a hole in one every time. I would line up right here, angle it around that way, see if I can find the hole. I can't even see the hole. There's so much debris and gunk and gook. It was right around in here. See how that little area there where there's like a ravine, the ball would travel around and right around towards the hole right down in here. Actually, it might have been right here. I can't remember. It's been so long. It's probably been about 10 or 15 years. Look at this. It's like a heart shape. Look at that. It's saying I love you. I love you too, River Adventure Golf. A lot of memories. They used to have big um, lions and tigers out here. You can see that in the other video. So watch the other video, which is also desolate, but nowhere near as desolate as this. Pretty wild. Memories here in Kissimmee. Thanks for joining me. And like I said before, I really want to thank everyone for joining me on this daily video. My main channel, Adam the Woo channel, and this channel, The Daily Woo. If you subscribed up here, I'm going to see you tomorrow. Also want to let you guys know I have t-shirts down below at the woo.spreadshirt.com and today and today only they're having a discount where it's free shipping anywhere in the US. I'll put the code down below on what the coupon code is. So if you want a t-shirt, go over to my website at the woo.spreadshirt.com. I'm gonna give you a coupon code. You can get free shipping today only. It's a thing that Spreadshirt is doing for today only. Thanks again everybody. Really appreciate it. A lot of memories here. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.